What I love most about living at Barking Riverside is for accessibility to be close to London but have my own little village. You've got the Thames right here next to us. Also, you can get into central London within like 20 minutes. On a nice sunny day, running by the river is really, really, really lovely. We've heard of Barking Riverside and it was you know, quite an exciting new project and a station coming and for the same price as a one bed flat in Zone 3, we managed to get a house. I'd definitely say that buying here was a better choice than renting. There's a lot to come in the future. It's very promising, it's very exciting. I like the ecology initiatives we have in the area, such as MVAC, which allows us to have clean streets, not waste trucks coming into the area. We have a new train station coming soon. We have the Uber boats coming. There's a lot of innovative, exciting projects happening in the area, and most of them are resident-led. We have got the Barking Food Forest. It's for residents to grow their own fruit and veg. We've had Shakespeare's Globe Company come here. We've had exhibitions, and it's an area where there's a lot of potential. Over the summer, we've all been getting into DIY, been sharing our tools, and now we have a, a little group of, of neighbours that we just meet. I never thought I'd get that in London. I absolutely love the wild centre, to sit down, have a coffee, potentially do some work. I feel like I am connected to the people around it and the environment. There is a genuine sense of belonging living at Barking Riverside. People think, oh, Barking Riverside, I want to go there, I want to visit. Whatever you want to be here can be here.